if you get this error message in Ghost of Tsushima, which says failed to initialize PlayStation PC SDK, then in this tutorial, I will guide you on how to fix this problem. Now, listen to this tutorial very carefully. The reason you get this error is because you are missing some PSN SDK files. Now, there is a backup file of Sony Interactive Entertainment. So, there is a backup file which I will show you. So, if you go here, go to the files here, there is a backup file of Sony Interactive Inc., which is a RAR file which needs to be extracted. Now, you will need to download it, which the link will be available on the description. Now, after downloading this Sony Interactive Entertainment folder, then just come here and extract it. So go to your folder. Now just extract this file. It has like 261 megabyte. It's compressed. Now after extracting this file, which is a RAR file, now just you will find this like this. Now this Sony Interactive SDK contains some, this is Sony Interactive folder contains some SDK files. As you can see, there are a lot of files here. Now after extracting, just copy this. Just copy it like this, go to this PC, go to local disk C, go to program data, here's a program data. If you don't see the program data, just select view and make sure hidden items is checked here. Now on the program data, just open the program data and paste the folder here. As you see, I have already posted the folder, which is Sony Interactive Inc. So I won't paste it again. So as you can see, the folder is here. I've already pasted here now. After pasting this folder, now follow the instruction here now. After pasting the folder, since you, you have some missing PSN SDK files, after that, you can try to relaunch the game to see if the issue can be resolved. Actually, this file was shared by a Reddit user. Someone was facing this issue on Reddit and someone shared this file, which a lot of people actually found it very useful. So I'm sure you'll also found it very useful. I'll see a lot of positive response, which here did help. Thank you very much. So try to do it. And if it fails, then follow the instruction again here. Now, if it still shows you the same error, now try the following. Go to the game folder and run this one. Go to the game folder where you have installed Ghost of Tsushima and run this one, which is PSPC SDK Runtime Installer.msi. Here's how to find your game installation folder. Now, on Steam, if you've downloaded the game on Steam, head to the game in your Steam library and click, right click on Ghost of Tsushima and select properties. Click installed files and click brews. Now, if you install the game on Epic Games Store, go to the game in your Epic library, right click on it and select manage. Next to installation, click the small folder icon and there you'll find the game installation folder. Now, once you've found the game installation folder, look for this, which is PSPC SDK Runtime Installer.msi. Just run this one application. After running this application, just right click and open. After opening this and then follow the instruction again. Now, then go to the C program data, Sony Interactive Entertainment Inc. PSPC SDK S22. Then you'll find this and run the PSPC SDK app MRG. So run the game. The problem should be fixed. Now, let me show you. So let's go to program data. So this PC, local disk C, and then program data here. Now you'll find the folder which you've pasted, which is Sony Interactive Inc. Entertainment. Open it and then open it again then open this, then open S22, and then open it again and look for the folder which I've shown you there on the script. Now in the folder name is this one, which is PSPC SDK app MRG.exe. Apologize for the typing error. The application that should be run is PSPC SDK app MGR. But here on the document I have written is PSPC SDK app MRG. So it's just a typing error. It's PSPC SDK app MGR as it is written here on the folder. So if you go to the installation folder for Sony Interactive Inc, it's PSPC SDK app MGR. So this one should be run and not MG MRG. It's PSPC SDK app MGR. So here is the file here, which is PSPC, PSPC SDK app MGR. What you need to do, just run this application. I will just open it. After opening it, your problem should be resolved. So Make sure to follow the instruction I have shown you clearly and you'll be able to resolve this issue, which is failure to initialize PlayStation PC SDK.